But this guy here, he can save his life by sticking out his tongue. How does he do it? Thanks for asking. He lives in Australia, and in Australia, there's a lot of poisonous frogs. And those frogs will advertise to the world that they're poisonous by being very brightly colored. Blue, red, orange, yellow. They're saying, look at me. I'm not trying to hide from you. If you eat me, you will get sick. So I just said, he used to them, ah, you have a lot of grenouilles that are poisonous. There are advertisements to the other animals that are poisonous. There are many colors that are vif, like blue, rouge, orange. He has to not to hide. This guy here, he's not better, but he's not going to lie. Look at his tail. He can't use his tail to whip, so he can't defend himself with his tail. Legs. You think he can run really fast with those short, stubby legs? No. So he can't escape from his predators. He can't run with his tail. He can't run with his tail. He can't run with his tail. So if someone comes to eat him, if someone comes to eat him, I'm going to eat you. He's going to go, oh yeah? He's going to stick out his tongue at him. And the other animal is going to go, whoa! Okay, buddy. I don't want to eat anymore. Pourquoi qu'il veut sa langue? Il veut plus le manger. Pourquoi qu'il veut plus le manger quand il veut sa langue? Big muscles on your arms. It probably means you can lift heavy things. Si on a des gros muscles sur nos jambes, nos bras, ça veut dire qu'on peut lever des grosses choses. If you have big muscles in your cheeks, what do you think that means? Get your jacket. Get your jacket from him. You can eat. You can fight really, really hard. He put my, he put balls in the fall. He's got big muscles on his cheeks. This guy has a very, 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 very strong bite. You would not want to get bitten by a, a tegu. He's got sharp teeth. Laws of sharp teeth. He is a carnivorous animal, which means that he eats meat. These guys can definitely rip pieces of meat off of a gazelle with their teeth and their strong jaws. Okay, so it's a carnivore. He veut dire, he veut facilement arracher des morceaux de viande sur une gazelle avec ses dents très pointues et une mâchoire très puissante. I'm going to get to move around like that. I'm going to have a seat there. Okay, go sit with your sister over there. Can you do that? I just want to make sure I keep an eye on everything because I'm always moving around. It's, if Stel decides to, to whip around, it would not be very What's the difference between a water turtle and a land turtle? I bet you everybody knows the answer now. What's the answer? Do you know? I think it's because has to do with where they live. Between a land turtle and a water turtle. <laughs> What's the answer? Where they live. That's right. If I put Flash in water, Flash would float there. But he wouldn't be able to get anywhere because he's missing something on his feet. Si je mets dans l'eau, il va pouvoir flotter. Mais il manque quelque chose sur ses pieds. Quels sont les pieds qui ont les tortues qui vivent dans l'eau? Ils ont les pieds palmés. Turtles that live in water have webbed feet so they can swim. This guy has little elephant feet. So eventually he would drown if I put him in water. And not an alligator. He's not a crocodile. He is a caiman. Not very good. C'est pas un crocodile dans les gazons. C'est qu'est-ce qu'on appelle un caiman. C'est un cousin des crocodiles des gazons. Ça fait partie de la famille des crocodiliens. He is part of the crocodilian family, which is cousin to crocodiles, alligators. Now crocodiles have very powerful jaws. And that's why I put a piece of tape on his mouth so he can't open his mouth. He's got lots of muscles. To close his mouth. Il y a beaucoup de muscles très forts pour fermer leur bouche. But they don't have lots of muscles to open their mouth. Il y a pas beaucoup de muscles pour ouvrir leur bouche. Even without the tape on his mouth. I can easily keep his mouth shut with two little fingers like this and he would not be strong enough to open his mouth. But if his mouth was open, my fingers were nearby, I could definitely say bye bye to my fingers, right? That's how strong his muscles are to close. So the muscles pour ouvrir la bouche sont pas très forts, mais mes doigts sont assez forts pour garder sa bouche fermée. Mais sa bouche, si sa bouche est ouverte, je ne peux pas mettre les doigts là, parce que je perdais mon de mes doigts pour sûr. Now you can see that his teeth are still sticking out of his mouth, so even with the tape on his mouth, he is still a dangerous animal. He can swing his head back and forth, and he can cut us open with those teeth. That's why I don't want anybody close to his face. 